So here we're going to get through this tough looking question by really sticking to some of our fundamentals. We're being told that all this information pertains to a line. It's a linear relationship. And what do we know about finding the equation of a line? Generally, you're going to always want to find the slope first, y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. And if you're given a slope and a y-intercept, then you'll use the slope-intercept formula. But if you're given a point and a slope, then you'll use the point-slope formula. So we'll start here by getting the slope. Slope is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So let's say 21 minus 24 over negative s minus negative 2s. 21 minus 24 over negative s minus negative 2s. 21 minus 24 is negative 3. Negative s minus negative 2s, that's negative s plus 2s. And so that'll give you negative 3 over positive s. Negative 1 plus 2 is just 1. And so one single negative sign makes the whole thing negative. Negative 3 over s. And of course, we don't have a y-intercept because the y-intercept is the place where x would equal 0. And none of these have zeros for the x's. So we'll use the point-slope equation of a line. y minus y1 equals m x minus x1. And so I'm going to want to pick the easiest point I can, which is the one that has no negative signs. So we'll say x is s, y is 15. y minus 15 equals negative 3 over s, x minus s. And so this is the equation of the line. And what we're being asked for now is to put it into standard form. ax plus by equals c. And all we have to do there is just kind of start simplifying. So what I might do right now first is multiply everything by s because that'll get rid of that denominator that makes this more complicated. So that'll give us s y minus 15 s equals negative 3 parentheses x minus s. So in other words, this canceled with this, leaving us with everything else. Now maybe distribute on the right, s y minus 15 s equals negative 3 x plus 3s. And now what we're trying to do is get standard form. So we're trying to get x and y on one side and everything else on the other side. So I may just want to add 3x to both sides and also add 15s to both sides. So on the left-hand side, we're going to have 3 x plus s y this canceled this also canceled so we'll have on the other side 18 s and believe it or not what we have here perfectly matches answer choice b for number 15.